warning signs are usually there, including memory loss that disrupts daily life, difficulty completing familiar tasks, and confusion with time or place. People often mistake them as part of the natural aging process. How much of that is from a disease like Alzheimer's disease that's attacking the memory center of the brain and how much of it's normal aging? Those are the areas that we focus on and try and differentiate so that people can start planning for their future. Dr. Michael Robb is a geriatrician who works to screen patients for Alzheimer's disease. We do regular MRI scans and look at the structure of the brain. Um, has there been excessive shrinkage in the memory center? That's only one facet of the comprehensive evaluation done at Lee Memory Care. We're fortunate to have neuropsychologists that spend about three hours interviewing people doing standardized tests where they, where they are able to compare the person against their age-related norms. Patients will also undergo a physical exam. It looks at how the brain controls balance and how well someone can move from one position to another and how quickly they can do it. Testing smells is another tool experts use in making a diagnosis. We look at the olfactory sensation, which can evoke a lot of memories, as you know, from smell. Looking at all these can flesh out a full picture and give those diagnosed with Alzheimer's the benefit of time. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.